welcome to my channel welcome to motivational monday how you all doing i'm sorry it's late in the day i do apologize for that but there's a very clear um video that we're going to make today about imposter syndrome now i keep being asked and you may have seen this morning i uploaded a video which i made on the sunday of southport which if you haven't seen it go and watch it and i just basically said i didn't feel very much on that day because of imposter syndrome and i have had inbox messages after inbox messages saying what is imposter syndrome what was you feeling like can you explain so yes i will explain in this video and there's a very good reason um, that this video is late and this is going to take me nicely onto imposter syndrome so i didn't have makeup on earlier i knew i was coming out this evening so i thought i will wait till i've got my makeup on and then i will make the video okay that's not imposter syndrome as such but what i'm basically saying is I didn't feel like I wanted to make this video until I looked a certain way and there's so much about that that is part of imposter syndrome so what it is is when you're feeling as though um, generally let, let me put it this way okay so you know I'm a writer now I imagine doing my book signings and all of that and I imagine me standing there thinking oh my goodness who the heck do I think I am so by going who the hell do I think I am that's you thinking that you're not worthy of being there or being a certain place or whatnot so on the Sunday of South Paul no yeah Sunday yeah that's right um which is a dance weekend I was there thinking oh my god there's so many better dancers here than me what am I doing in this room thinking that I could dance who the hell you know do I think I am and that's a little bit crazy because I've been coming a long time now and I can find my way around the floor quite nicely. So it's just a little bit of sort of, it's almost like self-doubt, but it's an actual thing and you can Wikipedia it and have a look at imposter syndrome. So it's an actual thing where you sort of feel as though, who do I think I am doing this, you know? And it's a little bit of uh, you feeling like you're not quite worthy. And I'm here to tell you that you're worthy. You're as good as the next person and why shouldn't you be doing stuff? So if I'd uploaded a video it's probably a bad example the makeup one but if i'd have uploaded a video this morning um before i had my makeup on i would be as pleased with it as i am now and that's not me ch i'm not actually a different person or i don't look massively different i mean some people really can can't they when, when they put like loads of makeup on they can look like two completely different people i wouldn't say it's imposter syndrome because you're still the same but you know you've changed a few things and it changes the way that you act so to get rid of that well, this was really my point in today's video we all get it at some stage or another now i'm not one of the 20 something youtubers that you'll see out there giving advice i've lived a lot men a lot more years than those guys and i can tell you something it doesn't go away you always wonder can i do better with this or can i be more successful at that or if i tried harder you know it doesn't go away and i know people who are like older than me who are saying exactly the same thing so when it comes along, when you're sort of thinking, who do I think I am doing this or saying that I'm trying to... If you don't try and push yourself, you're never going to get there. You're never going to benefit. You're never going to be any better than you already are. So just go for it and just be safe in the knowledge that you're going to get these wobbles where you think, what the heck am I doing? Um, and I had that and I got told off big time by my friend. I said to her, you know what, I'm not sure about this dancing. It's getting to the stage. It's quite painful to do and I'm not as good as I as I, you know, I'm not improving anymore and it's the time for the kids and I should step out of the spotlight and into the shadows. And she was like, you're not stopping dancing. What the heck are you talking about? So it's just me having a wobble basically and that's a posh word for that is imposter syndrome. So you're there thinking, I am not really this person that deserves to be here or belongs to be here. It belongs to be here. You know what I mean? Um, but just go with it, let that sort of storm pass over and know that you're gonna come out the other side and you'll be like, why did I think like that? That was really crazy, that was dark that day. So you've got this, you can do it. And if I could do it, anyone can. I'll tell you what, I started off initially, me on YouTube, I was like, I mean, 10 years this year that I've been doing YouTube. And um, when I started looking at it, I thought, oh, I really don't know about that. And then I watched somebody who was just completely more balmy than me. And uh, she was like getting a really good audience. I thought there's an audience for everything. So, you know, we have a go, we do these things. And there's loads of you out there that inbox me and say that I'm really helping, which is just fantastic. Thank you so much for those messages because that really does make me feel as though it's quite a special thing. I need petrol and damn, and diesel. Sorry, planet, 
Um, okay, so yeah, that's it from me this week. Make sure if you're feeling like an imposter that you just know it's just part of something that you're feeling. Let it go away and then come back to being you again and be absolutely unquestionably you and unapologetically you. Um, it's something that I'm really work working hard on in my life at the moment because we all have these little things that you're just a little bit, oh, I'm not sure, but you're all right, you're fine and everything will be fine. Trust me, trust me. Um, anyway, take care guys. There's going to be loads of videos coming up. I'm working really hard on my edits. I've been at it all weekend. I have not stopped and I'm trying to like get a bit more sleep and stuff, but it's not happening because I'm just so excited to get these edits up. I've got loads of stuff coming this way. So make sure if you haven't already subscribed, subscribe to the channel. And if this video is at all helpful to you, please give it a thumbs up because that lets me know that I'm helping going over the bumps uh, that I'm helping and it, it means a lot it does mean a lot um, you've no idea the subscriber count is still going up which is just insane um, and then next week there's going to be a new lot of travel videos coming up after these ones are uploaded so we've got centre parks and two blue marmorists coming up two blue marmorists from last year and there's going to be another video which might not be for a couple of weeks actually until we come back from Montenegro um, which is going to be a bit of a raw one about caring for somebody with dementia so um that's going to be interesting it's all to play for it's all happening life is treating me so well right now i'm very very blessed but it's not always like that and i want you guys to know that you know that is real life we have our ups and downs and all you've got to do is just try and think okay it's going to pass over and just be as positive as you can through it it isn't always easy and it's not even about faking it till you make it i want to talk to you guys sometime about abraham hicks um have a little google now if you like but when this video is finished obviously but with abraham hicks says it's not always about faking till you make it it's about the energy that you're giving off so if you're pretending that you're completely fine it's kind of going to help a little bit but you need to get that energy in that place as well so do whatever you need to do to raise that vibration oh my god this is seven minutes long this video this was going to be a quick one anyway thanks again for watching and i'll see you next time